Dave. Yeah. Tell us how legit this is. We are at the Jordan River, a place that they never let anybody in. It's guarded by the military, but this is uh, supposed to be the most legit spot where Jesus was baptized, where um, the children of Israel crossed over the Jordan River into Jericho. Mount Nebo is right across. That's how they know that this is the right spot. So this is like a very rare experience where not very many people get to go in here, but today we get to go in. Hey Tessa, where are we? We're at the Jordan River. So what is that right there? What? What is that? That's the river. That, I get it. Okay. Hey, I guess they, uh, I guess they couldn't swim back in the day, and they had to part that. Uh, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> what? That's the Jordan River. Wow. Hey John, how do you feel? I feel like it looks like a muddy river. And there are a lot of better rivers in Damascus, just bathing in the words of the dude. Hey, Christina. Yeah? How do you feel? <laughs> you and your red eye. Good. I'm happy to be here. And, Where uh, are we? At the Jordan River. The Jordan and River? Where Jesus <laughs> was baptized and the Holy Spirit came on him with power. The power. Hey, so we're going to get a double portion of uh, Elijah. Right now? Yes. I receive. Of God. Double portion of God. If you look straight ahead, you can see where they planted a sacred Greek Orthodox <laughs> dome right over <laughs> right over uh, where you know Jesus was baptized and where Joshua parted the, this incredible mighty river. We're about to we're about to bathe in that river. Let's How do you go feel? bathe, man. I'm ready. I brought some extra shorts. Yeah. So uh, we just wanted to say hi to everyone back home who's uh, freezing their tails <laughs> off. We're here in like 75, 80 degree weather in the desert, just chilling next to the Jordan Check. River. One, two, three. And uh, behind us we got a team. Oh. Check. We got a team that's just blazing it up and uh, fixing to be rocking around the clock. And then we're gonna all go get baptized down in the in the. spot where uh, Joshua crossed the Jordan River from Jordan into Israel and on into Jericho so praise the Lord and have fun all bundled up while we're out here getting a tan we're out here getting a tan while you guys are bundling up your arm. these are my swim shorts oh we're, my we're fixing to go swimming Good morning everyone <laughs> how do you feel I'm into the middle I know it's uh, awesome we're trying to interrupt an important Video oh, footage. Yeah, that was important. Yeah, that was important. Yeah, that was important. You, tried to, you tried to mess it up. That was important. I was going to say a different word, and then we wouldn't have been able to view this for all you guys back Still, re still recording. It's still recording. <laughs> hey, what's your name? <laughs> what's your name? Ramen. Ramen? Ben. Ben? I think ben, his name ben. is Ben. Ben. This is Ben. Hi, Ben. Ben. Oh, ben. So All right, you gonna take a picture with her? Yeah, okay. Who's taking a picture? Who's taking a picture? Awesome, high five. Yeah. <laughs> How do you feel? That's so awesome. It's, I've never like experienced this before. People that are just so fascinated. Like you know, you see, hear stories and see videos of other missionaries, you know, going out and stuff. It's just, it's a surreal experience to finally like be one of those people. It's really cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like she said. Wait, wait. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Hey, yeah. 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 <laughs> <sighs> Nothing's better than getting a little William Seymour action, keeping your head in a bucket. But uh, anyway, just wanted to give you guys an update on what happened today. We had, this is day three, we had an awesome day today. We had the 
amazing opportunity to go down to the Jordan River to the very spot where Jesus was baptized by John the Baptist. Not the tourist trap that all you guys have gone to before and you like to go home and tell all your friends that you got baptized in the Jordan. We went to the legit spot where both Israel and Jordan recognized that Jesus was baptized right there. Anyway, not to make anybody jealous or anything. <laughs> so we were down there and I just want to share with you guys a few amazing stories that happened while we were down there. First off, it was just amazing to be able to go in there. Like We had to go like clearance with the military. We met them with a truck. They drove us through minefields to the border because it was like a military zone. And it was like really, really like, yeah, it was just, yeah. I'll let you fill in the adjective there um, or just let them edit this out of the video. Anyway, so like we're driving through the, through the minefield and we get to the actual spot of the Jordan and we, we go down and... And uh, they changed rules like three times while we were there. At first, they're like, okay, well, you guys can worship, and then you can take five people down at a time and go baptize. And then it turned into, well, you can take ten people down. And then there's like, ah, oh, forget it. Everybody come down. And so all, we had all these people jumping down into the Jordan, and we had um, several Arabs with us um, from the Jericho uh, project going on with Karen. And they came, and it was like monumental to see, like, them get baptized and for those of you who don't know like for a muslim to get baptized it's like death to their old self i mean like once you get baptized you can't be a muslim again and like you for them it's like turning your back on your family if you're a business owner your business is boycotted i mean it's like it literally is death to the old man and life to the new so it's just mm -hmm. awesome to see that and um one of the one of them today it was like amazing when we were when he was praying and we were doing worship before everybody was getting baptized he was praying for like a really long time and a lot of people were like, man, this guy's just going off on a loop. But he said that he kept praying because he was seeing this vision of a bird um, coming down from the sky. And he just kept coming down and coming down and coming down. And when he actually went and was baptized, he said that it landed on him. And then he, he heard the voice of the Lord say, you are my son and who I'm well pleased. And, uh, and this guy had like no clue that like that same thing had happened to Jesus and so like he he got to actually witness the Holy Spirit descending on him right there at the very spot where Jesus was baptized it's just like this monumental moment and getting to see all these Muslims like baptized it's like watching the end times fulfilled you know like the very like people that the Lord is going to use to provoke the Jews to jealousy um, so God has just like put us at the spearhead of just like praying and cracking open the eastern mm -hmm. side of the nation and just like allowing his presence to flood in. So it's been an amazing opportunity and really just an honor and a privilege to be here.